New tonight, are saguaros in the valley under threat? That's what the Saguaro Census Project wants to find out. A group here in Phoenix wants to find out how heat and dry climate is affecting these plants. And they are hoping that you can help document saguaros in your neighborhood. Alexis Dominguez joins us live tonight. Alexis, what can you tell us about these beloved plants here in Arizona? Yeah, to Jamie, if you've lived here in Arizona, you know saguaros are a staple. Not only are they found here in the mountains, like at Phoenix Mountain Preserve, but they're also in people's yards. But now we're learning that Arizona's record heat and dry climate may be affecting their overall health. 2020 was historically one of the hottest and driest summers for us ever. Uh, which really had an impact on both urban and wild saguaros. Saguaros are not currently listed as threatened or endangered, but Jenny Davis, Ecoflora Engagement Coordinator, tells us the Desert Botanical Garden has seen an increase in saguaros falling over or even losing arms. Phoenix is a heat island, so with the built environment, concrete, asphalt, glass reflecting off of buildings, our temperatures are hotter uh, in the city uh, as opposed to, you know, natural wild open desert. Now she says they don't know exactly what's causing this, but they assume it may be the heat. Still, they hope a saguaro census will help them determine the plant's response to heat and stress. We use that to make those observations and kind of get a count of how many saguaros are here in the metro Phoenix area and start to monitor them and kind of see uh, how climate change could impact them over time. And the community can be a part of the project by downloading an app on their phone called iNaturalist. Join the Metro Phoenix Saguaro Census Project and you can make observations of saguaros anywhere in urban areas. We don't want parks, we don't want natural areas, we want, you know, in front of schools, houses, things like that. Davis says the project will help the lead expert track the plant's health and track the differences between urban and wild saguaros and in turn, help the animals in Arizona that depend on them for water and shelter. Now that census will be taking place for the whole month of May. If you want to get involved, head to our website at azfamily.com for all of that information. Reporting live in Phoenix, Alexis Dominguez for Arizona's Family. Alexis, thank you. Now